Okay. Talk of the Wonder Dog. Lick Hitler. Lick Hitler. <laughs> and sounds, like, sounds like my mom early in the morning. Guess who is... <laughs> yeah, that song is known in Jackson, Michigan as Lick Steve's Mom. <laughs> anyway, on the phone with us now from Rhode Island, I believe. <laughs> Taco the Wonder Dog, oh. ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Hi, this is Casey Kasem. We're up to our long-distance dedication, and this one is about kids and pets. Not a little situation we can all understand, whether we have I'm kids or pets or neither. Delay, am I? Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Meet the Press. <laughs> How are you doing, Taco? I a squirrel in the, the ice box. Really? <laughs> There's a squirrel in the ice box. Well, that, well, you have your dinner planned. Tell you, stop playing the let's get a laundry machine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the radio. Yes, you are. I got it. Uh, Let's class. You're in Rhode Island, aren't you? What? You're in Rhode Island, right? Hey, yeah. Are you near Quahog? I, I'm on Avid Neck Island. Cool. Yeah. yeah. Wow. They got that material. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Wow! <laughs> Whoo! Well, he's got the huh? he's got the oh, material man. going. <laughs> <laughs> he was set for us. Wow! Well, that the this and and the body and you gave me the pain right there, right there, and David Lynch like and you go and milk up in this the play noise and lens cloth. Sounds like our agent. Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. I was going to whip out the questionnaire by the Bernard Pivot questionnaire from inside the actor's studio, but I don't know. Are you are you up for that, Taco? Yeah. All right. Taco, what is your favorite word? <laughs> I thought it'd be Doritos for some reason. <laughs> Can I tell you something, Taco? Yeah. I got to tell you this. The, fir the first thing... The first thing I ever saw of yours was the Doritos animation, and Matt, our producer, showed it to me, and I had, within a minute, I had to leave the room. I was laughing so hard. I was either going to, I had just had like six tacos right before that, so I was either going to laugh so hard I would throw up. I had diarrhea that day, so I was in danger of, like, soiling myself, and you know how you get to laughing so hard that you get lightheaded and you almost pass out? We yeah, well, I than... had a pencil shop for a friend that I gave, gave me a friend box so that when I went around to collect the friends in the cage, like the monkey friend and the hamburger friend, I had to go to the kitchen and get in the gay car. Well, anyways, I had this friend box so that when I found the hamburger friend and the monkey friend, I could put the hamburger friend and the monkey friend in the friend box. Wow. I'm telling you, man, but I mean, that was so funny. That was either, I was either going to puke, crap myself, or pass out, or all three. Yeah, I'm making a game. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, you have to win the partner. Oh, that's the name of the game. What is it? Win the partner. Far out. That's, will that be on your site? Will that no. Be yes. That'll be available on the site? I have toys. Cool. Yeah. Well, no. No, no. There's one thing that's made up for and it's a fluffy boy and it's white and when you say it and you say it and then the thing's all it and then there's a bone and a llama steps on your head and you get a concussion and you have to go to the hospital. But at the hospital, they just kick you. They kick you in the face and they, they, they hit you with a little bit of newspaper and then you turn into a yak. Ah! <laughs> Taco, okay. I gotta tell I gotta tell you something. For me and Doug personally, you saved us last summer. Taco, I gotta ask you a question. What? What the heck is wrong with you? <laughs> Where do you come up with this stuff? Yes. I mean, it's brilliant. 
And now we're up to our long distance. <laughs> and this one is about kids and pets. Casey, and we're not talking to you. We're trying to talk to Taco. Hi, Casey. <laughs> this is Casey. Hi. <laughs> Oh, no. Dear Casey, Doing it's a to be a strange dead equation request, but it's quite sincere, and it'll mean a Doing lot to you play. Casey. Recently, there was a death in our family. He was a little dog named Snuggles. Oh, no. But he was most certainly oh, no. part of... Oh, no. Let's start again. Come, come Taco, in out of the record. Say the record, okay? <laughs> Can I ask you a question? Sure. How do you think you two will be regarded in the next century? In the, in the, what? How in are the, you going to be regarded in the next century? You two. I don't know. I, I can only hope we're, we're I hope regarded we're half, half as well as century. you. Because I mean, your stuff is I I really think that you're, the stuff you're putting out musically is the wave of the future. Yes. As well, far as I'm concerned. Uh, back in 1976, when the uh, the residents released their Satisfaction EP, a lot of people hailed it as being new wave. But yeah. later on, it was regarded as punk because, after all, it was made right before the term punk was yeah. really coined. And then um, later on, after they um, they had some success with the thing that they had some success with, they re-released the Satisfaction EP that had new cover art. And uh, the residents didn't necessarily prove of this and that, and the fact that their Eskimo project was taking a long time for them to complete, they, they fleed. They fleed. And they released Not Available. And the whole purpose of Not Available was that it was not to be released, that's the name. Yeah. It was not available, per se. <laughs> So that brings up a question, Taco. Uh, any plans to put out maybe an album? An album? Yeah. yeah well, um, right now I'm working on an album which explores um, a person's a person's lifespan metaphorically, uh -huh. um, and it treats it um, in a similar way to the Commodore 64 game that was released in the mid '80s, <laughs> Ex Machina, which um, was um, about a lifespan, and it included an audio tape that you would actually synchronize. As it, as it, as um, you were playing the game, and in the beginning would say, "Hello, what is I that noise right away?" Hi, young player. What are you doing down? And when you come back playing, at the screen is a clock. And it went and it around the famous uh, "All the world's a stage" quote from uh, Shakespeare's uh, Henry the Fifth, I believe. <laughs> hey, Taco. What, yes. What, what is that? Is that did the squirrel thaw out? Is that what we're hearing? The vial? No, the squirrel. Did the squirrel thaw out that was in the freezer? No, actually, that's just, that's just, that's, that's just, that's, that's just, that's, that's just, that's just hard. <laughs> what is that? I, I had some questions. I might as well just toss those out. <laughs> so I have you some know, questions I'm... that are guaranteed to shake you up. Okay. How much marriage urges a windmill to pinch infinity? Is a magic heart of bed the final home of Spanish fire? I have no idea. Can you give me a hint? What? Can you give me a hint? Veal. Okay. It has to veal. do with veal. It has to do with veal. Veal. Oh, veal of Clay Moisten's lens cloth. I should know this, too. Clay Moisten's <laughs> lens cloth is not meant for contact lenses. I'm not reading that off the back of the pa package of pre moistened lens cloth that I have in front of me. I have that memorized. I read this packaging on a frequent, on a, a, a frequent period during the day. About every 21 minutes and 32 seconds, I read the back of my box of pre moistened lens cloth, which are not meant for I wonder if Mrs. Taco is the exact same thing <laughs> here. Is Mrs. Ta is there a Mrs. Taco? Mrs. Just a second. <laughs> Oh no! I think we're gonna get to talk I, to her. Why, why did I open that? Why did I open? That? I don't know, but I guess I guess we're gonna find out. Okay, okay, I got something here. Okay, I'm getting a transmission. All right, hit us. It's Amelia Earhart. 
You're married to Amelia Earhart? Yes. Wow. Oh, yes. Cool. Yeah, and yeah. I, I'm seeing Niggasland's U2 single down below me, and I... This is Amelia Earhart. That's not, this is not me. How did this you find Amelia her? Earhart. Okay, I'm How Amelia How did you Earhart. find her? In the I'm personals, Amelia Earhart. obviously. Okay, okay. Okay. Dummy, dummy, no, 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 Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have to get the grapes. I have to get the... Hey, excuse me. <laughs> what, this, what have we seen? I don't know. <laughs> 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 Yeah, wow. we're here. Yeah. We're here. You you are just you are just too much, my friend. <laughs> yeah. Well, is there something in the water in Rhode Island we should know about? Hitler was a vegetarian. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I guess that answers my question. <laughs> I, somehow. <laughs> Man, I mean, uh, <laughs> how, how did you come up with all this? What what what, what inspires you? Yeah. What? What, well, what inspires you to do all this? How do you come up with this stuff? I mean, it's brilliant. It, it's dimensionally beautiful. You, I, <laughs> I, I am love. You're, you're the new Andy Kaufman in my, in my view. What is spirit? What is spirit? Uh, a new it, cologne from my, no. my new underwear. <laughs> spirit is a bone. Spirit. Is a bone. <laughs> I, th I think I saw that in an old seventies porno movie. <laughs> spirit <laughs> is a bone. Yeah, spirit is what a bone. bone. What is bone? Uh, it's a comic strip. Okay. <laughs> Do you want me to sing you a song? Yeah, sure, yeah. yeah. Sure. Hit us. Sure. Uh, what would you like me to sing? I can anything. sing any popular song that I know. Anything. Anything. Any anything. If, if, anything of your own or, or if now, you want well, to do a cover of something. Sing that or I could sing a popular song. Go for Assuming, it. Assuming, of course, that you have hey, the proper copyright clearance. Yeah. Hey, whatever you want to do, man. Copyright. Taco? Taco, no, whatever no, you want to do. Let me put it to Tell you what. this way. Don't, wait, can, we, can we take a break can real we quick? Break? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. We'll we take sure a break can. here. And uh, we'll we'll be treated to some live music from Taco the Wonder Dog. Stay tuned. We're back after this. Hi, my name is Susie. Every day during recess, I like to toss back a cold one and listen to WXUT eighty eight point three Toledo. <laughs> Okay, we're back. Yeah, we're back. And uh, WXUT, Primex Radio Show. Steve Her name's Susie, Doritos. and she said Dorito. And, <laughs> yes, and Dorito! we were talking to, and I tell you what, if, if I were the people at Frito-Lay, I would make a, commercial I would have you make that. a commercial for them out of that Doritos animation. Forget Jay Leno, this guy. Yeah. Oh, your song you wanted, right? Yeah, go for it. Yeah, go for it. Our well, show is your show. All right. Um, well, I'd like to sing a little song for you that you may have heard. <clears throat> it's called... Uh, uh, trying to think of a song that I know. I don't, I don't listen to a lot of songs because if I do, the ch chihuahua comes out of the ceiling. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to sing for you. Okay. Uh, Paranoid Android by Rent. No, I don't remember how that goes. Do I? Do I remember? Are I you allowed to do this? Is there a copyright law against me singing radio on Paranoid Android? No, I think we're cool. We're okay, cool. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to sing for radio head Paranoid Android. If I can remember how it starts. How does it start? Can you tell me how it starts? Uh, Matt? Matt? Don't look at me. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I'm just going to pretend to start it. Okay. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
I don't know if that's hey. the end or not, but I loved it. All right, you guys. Taco the Wonder you Dog. Did you tell me to get my mouth on. Taco the Wonder Dog live. <laughs> Standing man, ovation. that was that was fantastic. You you are the king. You are the king of comedy, my will you, friend. Will you have the MP3 of that on the site? Yeah, we're going to. We're going, going to? Yeah. Fantastic. Super. Fantastic. I, excellent. I, that that is a, that is one of the best. That is right up there. That has got to be a taco. Classic. That's up there with Lick Hitler and the Dorito song <laughs> yes. and Mr. Crazy Shoe Face. <laughs> yeah. Well, this side usually is swastikas on parade. Swastikas on parade is that is the name of that? No. Oh. I think that's going to be in okay. the uh, Disney World uh, well, the site, light orchestra thing. The site, for those of you wondering, is Geist Mag. No. No, no it's not. It. It's changed? They moved it. They moved it. Make a jazz noise here. Okay. Yeah, baby, right on, right on. Go for it. <laughs> Steve. Get one of those game show themes. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you really want me to play a game show theme right now? So you have, no, thanks. <laughs> you have a new website address? Yeah. Yes, I do. Okay, what is it? It's www.true. No, there's no www. Actually, if I remember correctly, my memory serves me right. There's no www. In fact, it doesn't work if you type in www. I think it only works if you don't type in www. It's truemeaningoflife.com. Truemeaningoflife.com. Slash taco. Slash taco. True meaning of life is good, run by my good friend Matt, who's the smartest man in the entire world. Is that our Matt? Or a different Matt? No, it's, a different it's Matt. you're you are Dave and Matt if if my memory serves me right. No, we're Doug and Steve. Oh, that's that's kind of close because one of them yeah. starts with a D. It's close enough. Yeah. So As they say Matt? in the commercial, close enough. Oh yeah, Matt I'm is Doug. the guy who got me this gig at showbiz. Yeah. People say Matt's our producer. Matt, Matt is our producer, Uber Lord, and genius. Yes. He's a genius, a super scientist, but it's who was ever living with him to kill us. Act like he is, but we will prove it to you, man. And uh, we, we are uh, Doug and Steve. I'm Steve, and that's Doug. I'm Doug, and Matt is here also. My, my own song, I'm Touched. I'm Far famous. out. Dude, you're, you're touched. Soon, soon you will a, be. A song for by a an song angel. That is fantastic. By an angel. Sometimes he is yeah. touched by an angel. One time I watched "Touched by an Angel" with subtitles. <laughs> what was that like? <laughs> it was the same except with subtitles. Oh, well, what, the, what were the, what language were the subtitles in? Carbonated water. <laughs> <laughs> okay, taco. All right, man. Taco, that was incredible. You, you are one, you, we, you are one of a kind, Taco. You you truly are. You are an original. I I say you're the way. It's the wave of the Hi, future. Hi, this is Casey Kasem. Hi, we're Casey. We're up to our long distance dedication, and this one is about <laughs> kids and pets and a little situation that we can all understand. Hi, Casey. This is I Casey. I hope I hope someday you get Casey Kasem's job. Wow, yes. I had my first gay experience. Yes. <laughs> and let me tell you, it was great. <laughs> I hope was it good for you too? Yes. Taco, Taco, this is Casey. I like your style. You can take this show anytime. Hi, Taco, I hope you're Casey Casey. Negative Lens U2 single can still not be legally released, and it's all my fault. I am a horrible monster, and I pray for death. <laughs> I wish I could do Chubby Checker right now, for yeah. him, but I don't think. Hey, I'll tell you what. Can, can you do something based on Chubby Checker? Because he is—he's is yeah. even more of a psycho Chubby than Casey Checker, Kasem. Hey, you mean that the one who did that song, "Let's Twist Again"? Yeah, yeah, he's even more of a psycho than than Casey Kasem. Yeah, well, that's quite a coinky thing. Because listen to what I have right here. Oh, I have wow. my good friend Hitler. In no the way. Room. Oh no. Do I get a chance to rebuttal? <laughs> Oh, no. Yeah! Hitler! Hitler doing the twist! <laughs> Hitler! Straight up! Far out! That chubby checker! That is, is, that is good! Wow! You did good! That is fantastic! <laughs> I, hope you, I hope that's on the site too. Yeah, well, 
as you know, my website is on the internet, and on the internet, there's a lot of other interesting things too. Like recently, I was using a website that allows you to search other sites on the internet, and while searching other sites on the internet, I soon discovered a site that had a link to another site. Now, on the site that was linked to by this other site, which I found on the search engine, which allows me to search other sites, I found a link to the same search engine. It's like an infinite loop, and you know what? It's like a snake eating its own tail. Yeah, really. I know exactly what you mean, man. <laughs> yeah, it's like vomiting up and then taking that vomit and eating it again and then and vomiting then it up again. Throwing it up again. <laughs> and then just re repeating the whole thing. Like process. a dog returns to his vomit. Yeah. A exactly. Christian will return to the Bible. Yep. Oh, man. So we got to wrap it up, man. The taco it was fantastic. Taco, we hope to have you on again. Yeah. What? We hope to have you on again sometime. We got to wrap it up. Okay, but man, wrap it, it up. It was unbelievable. Um, it was unbelievable. What kind of rap is this? Was my last comment? I'd like uh, to ask. I don't know. Is this the one that involves big, dumb, fake gold chains? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, more like uh, wrapping things up. But we could do a rap about uh, wrapping things up. Yeah, like yo, okay. yo, my name is Taco. I'll hit you with a Rocco's Modern Life, which was unfortunately canceled by Nickelodeon. Also canceled John Pickleslowski's show, and now he has a new show on Fox Kids, which is actually kind of mediocre. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we just jam with Taco the Wonder Dog, Steve. It don't get any better than that. Taco, Taco man. thank yep. you, bro. Thank you, man. You All right, bye, bye bye. Listen, listen, you saved us this summer. You saved us in fall, buddy. You are the man. The dog. The, the dog. Wonder dog. The dog. The Wonder Dog. You are the Wonder Dog. All right, this is KMWF with your host Dick Vaughn. Remember, don't touch that dial. It's got dick on it. <laughs> <laughs> Talk of the Wonder Dog, ladies and gentlemen. This is the Prybax Radio Show. And on the, on the let's hear another on one of his songs from 